Patents Day, judgment against the twins went well. Anger and crowd for a passing death sentence, but uproarious applause upon pardon. So much for stealing bread and piece of mutton, sentenced to stocks and returned to workhouse. Will diminish whispers about mistrials and overlooking accidents on bridge. Locksman's Day, visit at Montrose, need more to pave my way to promotion. Agreed on trying usurer's favor. Forger's Day, kiss a jack in my hands, good fortune shines on me. Trial and, trial and execution will impress crowd. Advance my case at the watch. Motos unsuccessful at raising money, but received notes of Gerald Foxley, independent, trying to pawn antique in the grain of regrets. Arranged, arranged meetings with Archibald Flint, master of Fiddler's Hill and its, and its thieves, all acquaintances, could be mutually agreeable. Montrose still doubtful. Mason's Day, rushed through hanging of Gilbert the Goose, trap door open near early, terrible suffocation. Lissel the maid broke down, ugly mood in crowd. We really need Skizer Jack to make them forget this. Archibald returned, note an agreed on exchange, doesn't care who delivers Grail, Foxley or us. Montrose seems to have good cold, cold feet, but I would rather throw him off bridge personally than let his one slip, slip out of our hands. Blacksmith reported missing two days, first suspicious disappearance in month after locksmith and wine merchant. Must wait until after doing away with his foxley. Must remember to tell boys to drag body in as proof of one more fee finished. I don't exactly like that. Oh, it's this door. But just, just 30 seconds, guys.
And back, sorry for that. Okay. This is the bridge from which I was dropped quite the fall. I'm impressed I survived it, but I did. And this is the high spot of the map. Now this place is Quite tricky. <coughs> there are a lot of people around, and it's actually rather well lit. going to do you in. Just don't poke your head again into the master's private quarters, don't piff on arrows from the armory, and don't throw stuff at people down below the bridge. Don't go the average, see? And it will be fine. Next time, leave the firewood before the bedroom door. That's good enough for him. takes a long time because he has a long patrol route.
returning from the summer. The ranch shall get their daily ration of wine as ordered, and I do not want them getting into more of the stuff while on duty. This place is key at your own risk, Montrose. We don't need this key anymore because we accessed the cellar with a skeleton key. I'll keep it just so that servant gets his ass whacked because I'm an asshole.
interesting that they give you so much so far into the mission. Now this is our way to our way to Montrose and the Bailiff. The problem is I needed uh, I needed water here, I don't have any. So this might be extremely difficult. We'll see how it goes. I don't think it's possible to... The guy just decided to barge in at the least opportune time. Which is unfortunate. I know I can blackjack the sentry, which is nice.
looking for. And now I need to spring uh, Skizzer Jack out of prison, basically. Good. It will be easier to catch. Come on, you're free, you bastard. And so we have completed that objective. Sadly, we need to gather the evidence about the uh, Grail's whereabouts, and I don't think it's possible to grab it without alerting everybody. It's not a chance. Because I ran out, I ran out of water arrows by using them like an idiot. <laughs> I fucking love ragdolls. <laughs> Not 
like this. I want to be able to throw it. Ah, I have an idea. I'm gonna drop something, and then I'm gonna drop a flash bomb. Treat this. <laughs> I'm really surprised it even worked. So, to the Honorable Archibald Fleet, by now my courier must have brought you this grade of regrets you have been looking for. Concern yourself not with the fate of its previous owner. I have it on good authority he has suffered an unfortunate accident. I would like you to consider the Grail a gift, a token of my goodwill if you like. My friend the Bailiff also assures you of his best in intentions and recommends that we should sit down and assess the possibilities of collaboration on the territory between Fiddler's Hill and all turf, as you will surely understand. Uh, <clears throat> looks like the dark book doesn't want to quit. Stuck for now. Ah, here we go.
right, let's load, uh, load dark loader. Then, where is Prowler? There we go, Prowler the Dock. Okay, I'm in. I'm just gonna read you the briefing first. The clients. Shit. Of course. There we go. Okay. The clients who require my services can come up with some pretty extravagant demands. Tonight I am to steal some old girl or another, supposedly invested with dark enchantment. <laughs> Whatever, as long as it pays. A fool and his money is easily parted, and who am I to lecture folks on their foolishness? Guarding the skull are a coterie of hammerites, doubtless out for an intruder to teach their tenants. Still, even if they guard that moldy relic with all their care, there is bound to be a loophole for a careful thief. <laughs> Fears always one. Set. Stop. Explode. So our objectives are pretty simple. We have to well, the hammerites in this area are in the position of a pagan skull of possible mystical import. Your task is to steal this artifact. You are good. You want and want to prove it by to your drinking powers. At least nine hundred in loot is needed to save your ambitions. The blood of innocence on your hands is bad for business. Don't harm anyone who is unarmed. And lastly, when all else is concluded, return to as you came through the Southern Gate. Now, probably, oops. Yeah, this is this will not work. I need to find another key to bind. Better, okay. <clears throat> so Prowler is another um, speed mapping experiment. It's a very small map. It was made in f three days, I think. It's very good, however. Hunt. Oh, fuck, I cannot read, sorry. I, I cannot read the text. I need to bind another key because as soon as I press a key in while reading a text, it just um, goes off. So bear with me. I'm sorry. There. I'm sorry. Um, I don't like using the. Um, uh, the mouse buttons to talk because it makes a clicking noise, but I have no choice here. Now 
Fifi is a very easy game compared to the dark mode. Saw thou something over there? Dead in, in the dark mode are pretty uh, unsettling as well. Who goes there? Who said that? Been pretty nasty. Mm. I know not what. I played all of Malen's missions uh, for the dark mode prior to uh, this. No, I'm not ghosting. I'm just playing uh, laid back. This one is very easy to ghost. Uh, the only difficult part is in the uh, uh, 
um, into the uh, cloister thing. Well, two difficult parts. Inside this room here with the machine, it's very difficult because it makes so much noise when you mantle on it. And the second difficult area is on the rooftops from the cloister. <laughs> because you have to mantle on a slanted surface and it makes a lot of Oh yeah, we have a machine room is horrible. <coughs> it took me so many tries to uh, to manage the um, the machine room without making any noise. Hold, send two bears wools and two stacks of firewood. Um, Brenner, do you and no pay yes for arbitration as a log? Dose, do you sh shifty behavior? Ask gods to check pub, find one from surgeon. Milford, recommend at Horace. Tomlinson, send eight crates iron. Ramirez, postpone. Mesa Bains, promised swift payment and talkies. Ask for unbeligned shipment. And that's it. Yeah, um, yeah, return to the city is the other side of the cloister. Mm. <gasps> Who's that? <gasps> Import the geometry of one into the other and uh, try to to make so that they work together. I don't know. Hope I'm making sense. Brothers, keep us vigilant, for it is said a prowler of the dark would seek entry into the Derek Church of the Pagans. Let us watch and patrol and ever protect Father Goliath, who is the keeper of the key.
Uh, you know, it's a small fanbish and I don't know if I'll ever finish it. Like I said, it was going to be ready for the first, but um, I haven't worked on it for two days. I don't know, but I, 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 I'd like to... Um, I've been working on Dark Radiant for the past few days. Um, I've been by Kajud and Milan on, on a mission, and I somehow I kind of want to uh, to make a mission for uh, the Dark Map. So... But yeah, I was uh, I was using um, the um, Necro Age textures, uh, some from the Canon pack and some from um, uh, Gecko's Gecko's pack. But really, uh, just one or, one or two because the others are really bad. And uh, and I don't know, it just looked nice, so why not? But yeah, um, Saltier's mission kind of impressed me. Not gonna lie. <laughs> well, I didn't like the gameplay that much. I think it was too um, too obscure, too difficult for its own good, too frustrating. what I could get last week. These guys are not so suspicious, but if they got me, I'd be bye-bye. They're up in arms about something or other deal, so no more for a while. And we should meet someplace else. They are watching the old old now. Now would be a good chum and set me up with that one thing you talked about. Roundabout's a fair play. Just you wait till I find oh, you. shit. Nah, fuck this asshole. Why this map is difficult to ghost is because of sound propagation. This room is broken. It should propagate through these holes, and it instead propagates through the windows. And was only rats. Well, the windows. You know what I mean. Sound that guy made is my favorite knockout sound in in the whole series. Vigilance is our shield. Nothing to see now. <laughs> Do my eyes show me the right? Like the hammerites, uh, they're so funny in Thief One. Not so much in Thief Two. Just because the voice acting is just better, man. Your Eminence, once again I ask you, permit me, permit me and my brothers to raise hammer and smash down that filth freedom den of sin that is festering right in front of our eyes. Doubt the builder's plan, not I, but what, what worth is a hammer if it cannot strike the iron? What worth is a hammer if it cannot smite deviltry? 
The sins of the ancients rise up against your servant, and now they say a stalking thief would take whatever is with him. No doubt to work unwholesome deeds. Surely you would agree that. Nay, this will not do. Better think and write on the morrow. Yay. Who comes unto me? All is at rest now. Twelve nothing. Yeah, he, uh, in Calendra's Legacy, I think uh, it's the uh, the only hammer voice in Thief 2. There's only one. <laughs> While in Thief 1, there's like three. I think it is three. Now, this is a very difficult part because as soon as you metal on that, you make noise. <laughs> At this time. <coughs> now, if I had a rope arrow, I could just rope up here because this is wood. Yeah, I'll show the Easter egg boy. <laughs> it looks like with, with new mantle, it's easier to don't make any noise, which is nice. What's that? Who goes? <laughs> Yeah, it's wood. This one is wood. There is another one that looks just like it, but it's twice as big and it's stone. And it's a bit more grey. <laughs> yeah, new mantle makes me silent. Oh, wow, <laughs> this is so good. <laughs> It's all for looting the mission. Ray! <laughs> well, part of the reason why I love the Dark Project so much is because it's so bizarre. Like, there's no game like it, not even 50 is like it. Oh yeah, okay, see. Well, that guy's blind. Ho 
ho ho, tuckers. There is an explosive mine if you want to wreak havoc. If you touch the walls, you are hurt, basically. And that's it. I don't have fire arrows. There's a one fire arrow. Still on me. minutes wow I took 20 minutes <laughs> all the loot all the pockets picked nine knockouts and uh, I killed a, um, a hunt I'm gonna grab a, um, a glass of water and then I'm gonna go play unbidden guest so see you uh, ASAP just gonna launch a thief two in the meantime
this through to the briefing first. Um, sometimes living, living in this city is more trouble than it's worth. There is a new sheriff in town, and he's waging his own personal war against crime. Dodging the law is part of the game, but Sheriff Gorman too has changed the rules. His men are in the hunt for suspicious individuals, and they are asking no questions. It was only by a hair's breadth that I escaped the ambush they set for me. This, was, this has left me without my usual contact, or a permanent address. Fortunately, with so many of the smaller wards empty after the recent calamities, there are vast areas to hide in as long as you don't venture into districts under guard so often. Sheriff Truett has enlisted the aid of a separatist sect of the Hammerites called Mechanists, every bit as fanatical as Hammerites and twice as industrious. They've been supplying the sheriff with some really nasty contraptions, mechanical eyes that seek out anyone who his spies considers a threat to the safety of the city. Word has that it, ha it, well, well, word has it that there is also plans for a new creations. So deadly it will bring every honest thief in the city to its knees. Fortunately, I found some unlikely allies in these dark times, the Hamrites, more bitter about the schism in their ranks than the few small sins I have committed in the eyes of a builder. And as the high priest outlined to me in the old quarter of all places, we have certain interests in common. Tonight, the mechanists are throwing a posh banquet for the city nobility in their seminary to win supporters and hold a demonstration of their most recent inventions. A beast of iron, invincible and untiring. If they can get these things into production, I might as well find another line of work. I'm going to cross their plans by sabotaging the display. The hammerites are supplying me with explosive devices I must plant in each metallic horror I come across. The streets are pretty hard these days, so I'll take to the rooftops and approach the seminary from above. If I cut through a building or two, I won't win any popularity contest, but then they don't call it the Thieves Highway for nothing. Traveling light is, the, is a necessity, since the districts in the area are full of the city's finest and well protected with security devices. I must trust the hammers to deliver a few useful tools as they have promised. A power station south of the ceremony is the supposed location of a cache. I will start in an old bell tower. One of the few friends I can still depend on will let me sleep in his attic for the evening. Afterwards, it will be time to make myself useful. With the cream of the city in attendance at the mechanist seminary and the wealthy households in the surrounding area ripe for picking, I will be at last I will uh, I will at last be like a kid in a candy store an unknown to all but me a trusted confidant. There may be yet more. The mechanists are said to have in their keeping an old book studded with gemstones and gold, apparently an, an ancient hammer text of some value. If I have a chance, I will make this book mine, and my friends will never know. No point in waiting. It's time to begin. So, um, as you probably noticed, this is a reinterpretation of the fifth two demo, the unwelcome guest. And it is a fifth one-like reinterpretation. Uh, reinterpretation. For some reason. Uh, the FM is called Music of Sybil, which is my mission, but whatever. <clears throat> oh, so he has released his mission. Cool. Um, are you making a branch side like mission? Uh, well, just create some giga stuff like, my, like, seriously, just go wild. So, our objectives <coughs> sabotage the iron machines in the mechanist seminary, the explosives the hammers have made for you. You claim you're the best, now prove it. Take to the Thieves Highway and grab 22,000 worth of loot. Well, 2,200. The mechanists are rumored to have a valuable old hammerite book in their seminary. See if the information is true, which is optional, but we'll get it. Don't draw undue attention to yourself tonight by triggering any alarms. This is a bug. 
You're a thief, not a murderer. Don't kill any servants on the ability. And once your other objectives have been completed, return to your starting point. Sounds fair. Sounds good enough. And we can't pay anything. And we have no map. Hey, the city looks almost bearable from up here. Actually, the first melon mission I played. Not bad dance, not disorientation, not pro the dark, but unbeaten guess. Now I've ghosted this before. It's not too difficult. The only difficult part is getting to the condom maker's shop without triggering, uh, without being spotted by the. Uh, the cameras, which is very, very, very difficult, because it relies entirely on luck. I'll be visiting this afterwards. The bill of your purchase is for three trophies, Beric, Cobra, Cray, and accompanying plates engraved as per your request. Please do send reimbursements by courier to our office. Trophy Beric, Trophy Cobra, and Trophy Cray, and then brass plates. A lot. They cost a lot. Yeah, this is so impressive. Further on, might we suggest other items of a hunting theme as chosen by customers who have purchased articles similar to yours, a beautifully engraved March bull horn, a decorated U composite bowl with brass and silver inlays, or a golden cup with rearing Burrick and Youngs. Guarding your inquiry, Bandersnatch Snatch is presently not in stock, but you will be informed forthwith if a specimen becomes available. Respectfully, Reginald Carstairs, a Mazinian importing company. <laughs> this is so fun. Valued friend, on behalf of the Order of the Mechanists, let me extend our invitation to you for a festive evening and following demonstration of the most marvelous devices. It has long been our wish that the best of the city know more about our work and goals. While we have continually sought to improve the lot of good and honest citizens, 
most recently by the ingenious seeking eyes of a good brother Rodolphus has supplied to Sheriff Truett, it cannot be denied that there are still many who judge us by the measure of our hoary forebears the Hamrites. Far it be it from the truth, while the old order, fallen to age and decrepitude, exhibited obduracy in face of progress and a moral inflexibility beyond judicious measure, we recognize the virtues of a pragmatic approach. Certainly, we would be foolish to reject those who move and shake this great city just because of some righteous flummery. Instead, we wish to discuss in all earnestness how the order can be of help to you and your household. This and other matters, and we will not be evasive, this can perhaps extend to your most valued contribution to our cause, are to be discussed at our seminary on the next eve. A repast of the goldsmith's tavern precedes the next day's demonstration, where our most recent work and astounding device that will protect your valuables from the hand of a thief shall be unveiled before the city's finest. Thereafter, a most exquisite prize, a bottle of Biddley Bomb Crew 78, is to be auctioned, with all proceeds going towards the invention of yet more wondrous works. To our privileged guests, beds will be surprised, uh, supplied sorry, at the seminary if you so request, and must assure by, that by no means do we cling to the doctrinaire austerity of our predecessors. Our eyes are on the future, and your service. On behalf of Grand Master Ridolfus, General of the Order, Master Tixpring. I have a good one. Good Master Willie, your instructions I follow the treacherous woman diligent, meet several men, foremost a young knight, but the others want two every day, complain of your guard, seaman who is done with. Say, beat to death if insult her more from under window, Oaks. This is of course a reference to Master Willy and Lady Van Vernon. And Lady Van Vernon is uh, said by the Master Willy's guards to be uh, a slut, basically. And it's true, she is. She's unfaithful. In framed, you can find document that proves it. And now here's my probably my favorite part of the mission. Well, bit of a mission. This is very creepy. She's a mirror. And it's us. It's Garrett. Now this is the same message, exactly the same, save for Lady. This is a letter from um, Patrick. Dearest Lady Van Vernon, allow me the impudence of introducing myself. I am a man of wealth and distinction, a lover of all beautiful things. You are, if I say so myself, a rare flower in this wretched city. Worry not that your marriage with, with Master Willie has gone sour. Maybe you have lost a husband, but be assured that you have gained a steadfast admirer. It is my considered opinion that you need a real man, someone who doesn't shirk from trials, and even a bit of noly now and then, not a pitiful weakling who couldn't even handle a bold barrack. Maybe we should meet some place to discuss further particulars. Might I suggest a cozy little tavern in Lanthair Hill, the weeping widow? I hear they serve the most excellent roast and the best wines in town. It is bound to be absolutely perfect at this time of the year. Yours ardently, Lord Bafford. Now there is a switch somewhere. It opens this. Um, there we go. 
happens with and it is impossible to see. Like if there's no way you can see. Oh yes you can actually, but yeah it's almost impossible to see. Fine tools for this night's work, fashioned with diligence and imbued with a builder's might against the deviltry of the upper states. Carry Val is with the utmost care, for within it's it, with his, with, uh, for within is enough force to kill all men the strongest men. Garrett, Val possesses much cunning and treachery, so Val can doubtless gain the fortress of the upper states. Once thou art within, seek Val their workshop and place one device within each iron machine therein so that they will surely rapture and be rendered useless when they are operated. A faithful brother who is working among the upper states has spied three of the unholy abominations, that is brought to garner favor and funding from the sinful in heart. More of the useful contraptions fashioned by all smiths are also here. What a good brother could bring under the gaze of his seeking eyes the apostate Rudolphus has constructed for the heretical sheriff Truitt. Take also the good sword here, as thou art said to wield it with good skill and elan. May the hammer fall upon the unrighteous. It can get you smart into a smith in exile. <laughs> Two things I want to visit. First, this area. <laughs> us to uh, Lady Van Vernon's again, but this time upstairs, in an area that was previously accessible. I've had enough of you! Do you see this alcove here? We fire a rope here or here. Jump. We can access this. Very well hidden. That was 
this one is really, really quiet. The zombie sleeps. No need for alarm, ladies, just passing through. I need these two fruits. Summons of a circle. The circle of roses shall convene the subsequent evening. Lady Luce Salon to discuss forthcoming issues pertinent to our society from a new Dionysian perspective. The clandestine character of the gathering is to, preser to be preserved in our gardens to be the covenant. Expected to be in attendance, Lady Artemisia Shemanov, Rose, Rose of the First Order, Lady Louisa de Perrin, Rose of the First Order, Lady Fantisa Alasri, Rose of the Second Order, Lady Marcella Eventroyd, Rose of the Second Order. The following articles have been proposed for the agenda. Vote on admitting Lady Alicia Van Vennen to the Circle Third Order, interlocution on behalf of a candidate by the sponsor, Lady Marcella Eventroyd. The Dianic Virtues of Nature Worship, Evidence from the Trickster Tablets, Lady Artemisia Shemanov. The Mechanists, Further Decay of the Hamrite Order or Research and Threat, Lady Artemisia Shemanov and Lady Louisa de Perrin. New Aesthetics and Undeport Youth, Thief Chic and Current Fashion, Lady Marcella Eventroyd. Necromantic Practices in the City's Connection with the Uttermost South, Lady Fandicia Alasri. The Atom of South, um, this is in the, the call of Cthulhu. Society finances and forthcoming expenses, Lady Louisa de Perrin. Any new articles are to be submitted by the fourth toll to one of the first order, unless it bears inordinate urgency in shadow and light, Lady Louisa de Perrin, Rose of the First Order. Master Rodolphus, 
I must report with the most disconcerting news that and only hope it will be it, uh, sorry I'm just restarting. I must report with the most disconcerting news and only hope it will not interfere with the agenda for this evening. The book of Elsewhere, that blackest folly of pagan wizardry in which the old court foolishly bound in gilt sheathings, and the mark of the hammer so that its magics would remain immanifest, has been stolen. Brother Leonard has recovered it from the leaden vault that was, and was busy prying the gems from its frame to gain all fertility and much needed wealth when he was called away to reprimand the wayward initiate and administer ca just castigation. As he was returning to his toils, did he spy the black form at the window, clinging to the bars, misshapen paw re reaching for the folio. Then did the intruder utter an unholy laugh, and snatching the works, faltered to the wall walk and fled northwards. It is my suggestion that a company of strong brothers be sent to the sealed quarter on the early morrow, for a watchman saw it bound across a flat roof and to the eastern gate with preternatural celerity. Clearly the work of the adversary from beyond is unmaking. Furthermore, I recommend that all valuables be stored in your lockbox from now on. There is little else to report other than minor matters. I must bring to your attention that the chest plate on, f on one of the iron machines is stuck and we will have to fetch a sturdy chisel to break it after the morning's display. Maybe the diamond cutter skins could be of help, although he has not been friendly with us before. There needs to be also a search for your spare workshop key, if it fell from your window, then it could have been snatched by someone in the neighborhood. This also will be arranged once we are free to offer present shorts. The builder be with you, Brother Dixbrick. Oh, you've already finished it? There's nothing there now. Access the garden directly from here with a good jump. Like this? But I don't find it very useful because you're trapped. Instead, we will take the. Oops! We will take the long way. Oh, okay.
wisst ihr, also so fucking steep. <lacht> so weird that this fire is still burning. But well, the torches are... no. It makes sense in the bottom of that they are light. This book, it is booby trapped. If you read it like this, you will have a zombie spawn behind you. However, there is a small glyph on it. If you manage to highlight it, you can take it away. And then you can read the book. The Book of Ism the Enchanter, Necromancer of the Optumnal Spire. May the hand uninitiated wither, may the flesh and coal be devoured, may the pure eye uninvited darken. It is I, Ism of the Autumn Spire, Necromancer and Ancient of Ability, who has written these pages. Praise Ism, for to him is bidden the book of elsewhere, that he seeks and that he will find, that is written. Then will Ism call the striding stalker, who will recover the book and place it under dream under earth. The players of the liar will guard the approach, but so will Ism's dream will, that is also written. Only fire will deter the players of the liar from the task, but none will deter ism, for to him is the book of elsewhere bidden, and he guards it with his life. Seek not ism in the morning, for his house may not be perceived at all, and seek him not in the evening, for he slays and devours as he will. Ism is ism, and none may say him nay. So the liar thing was a... <gasps> Is this statue that you have to illuminate with fire? And I did check, and it's only the statue, not the torches. Yeah, Melan has a really good style. Easy puzzle. You stand on this. <laughs> yeah, that was enough. Okay. Bizarre. Now, here's some 
would be interesting if you get to here you can see that something on the lights it's a gong yeah it's a spider uh, a spider ski it was all round and motions which are sadly inaccessible It is so cool, I don't even remember it in the original game. Yes, it's called this This looks like stuff. a hard place to sneak through. Now, I found that the best way to get the book is through the other side of the pedestal. But it's tricky to get. Granted, the last time I played this mission was not with New Dark. So. New Mantle probably um, fixed a bunch, of, bunch of stuff and made climbing easier. Garrett says this is a hard, hard place to sneak through, but actually this, is, this area is a breeze, it is extremely easy, as long as you are mindful. Oh, 
longer than I remember, actually. We have to put a moss here.
Guards! 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 There's a thief lurking about! I found- In the shadow hmm, there. Thought I saw something. How yes, oh, is this? Nothing there. <coughs> I can't believe he thought to charge so much for huh? that. Anyone like there? I got this money by tossing it left and right <gasps> to every single oh, rats. rats. Just rats, rats again. Impulsive. But all is my business, I said. that makes ghosting such a thing. It's because um, one of the cameras is uh, so I can't see him. We basically have to rely entirely on luck. It is pains to treat with you, I must bring to our attention a master of potential urgency. You simply have been the victim of multiple thefts, so far to small value, but with our trade we must stay vigilant. <coughs> now my glasses, then your tools, and tomorrow some rich lordings, lordings diamonds. I think I know the culprit. It is that kettle maker about my shop on his wave, either one of the other. We should put business to matters to say for a small time and go before Raputo together. Or if not him, the watch. Let us meet on the market after sunrise and present with this as a breach. Best get both birds onto the gallows to be sure. Well there.
spouse turkey is now um, so annoying to make in Jomet. And the word went before we reached our salvation. <laughs> It's a, it's a shame there is nothing up there because with a good repair room you can access this area. Space metal monstrosities. This looks so cheap. <laughs> Mm, 